Brown sugar, babe I guess high off your love, I don't know how to be hey, yo, the window to a star for a sign the reason why guys I'm already here um no in fact I don't think I spoke to you guys today so the time is 25 past 10 in the same a boat for bottomless mimosas diamond <laughs> Now. Hi guys! <laughs> so just forget to say guys. Um, but yeah, this is what I mean in general. Yeah, bottomless mimosas in Polo. Um, yeah, I'll I'll keep you know updated. And good night, up and the other stuff, guys. Let me actually show you. I told you, what are you? Hey, I, I'm not sure I'm feeling class I'm number two. <laughs> you do we think I'm class number two? Hmm? It's strong. And. I'm not. I'm not. I'm I wonder which champagne they use. Mm. But I don't think it's expensive. Mm. I don't even think about the champagne comes to sparkling wine because or prosecco because I'm about to see champagne mm. guys this is my second glass and the I feel the I feel um and we just got our food we ordered um breakfast we both have omelets let me show you guys Guys, this is my third drink. And the cool shut down because I was eating, so I'm not too tipsy. Um, yeah. Guys, fourth glass. Guys, I'm finally unboxing the coffee machine. I'm also shooting for TikTok because um, I just want to get in my home content era this year. So please let me know if, in fact, <laughs> you don't have to let me know of anything because I'm definitely going to be getting into my home content era. I, I kind of have to, like you, you know why soon, why I have to be, you know, be getting into this content, but yeah. Let me, I'm not sure if I'll attach the video that I did for TikTok or yeah, I don't know because I have to, I don't know guys, I, I don't know, but you'll see the unboxing. Guys, I'm excited to announce that I'm officially part of the coffee machine squad. Guys, I'm no longer going to be spending 60 rand, 70 rand on coffee 
daily before many one much in but first things first i need to remove this air fryer and this kettle from this area because this is where i'm going to be setting up my coffee station so yeah let me get to it So excited.
hi guys um if you're new here welcome if you're not thank you so much for coming back thank you for the support thank you for the love guys i'm not sure of the direction this vlog is gonna take um i'm not sure if i should be doing my intro um i'm just not sure like i'm not sure if i'll join today's footage with you know another vlog that i'm already recording sorry guys it's hot um yeah but if this is a new vlog welcome if it's not welcome <laughs> um yeah so right now i am going to bricks coffee in craig hall i am meeting up with Ualu. we met up yesterday and i guess we just had you know fun so we just decided let's do it again today we, yesterday we went we went to olives and plates and i did vlog quite a bit so i'm assuming by the time you see this you would have seen yesterday's footage um yeah yeah so let's go i will be vlogging today as well um she's also i'm assuming gonna be vlogging because yesterday she was vlogging she's also a youtuber um, I didn't even know like when I got there yesterday I'm like ah are you vlogging and I had left my camera because I didn't want to be that person because it was our first time meeting um, so today I'm like you know let me vlog let me let me also be in my youtuber era so yeah guys um, let's go to Briggs Coffee and Company in Craig Hall <laughs> So that's what we'll be doing right now um yeah i am gonna get unready with you i did put a bit of foundation on my face as you can see so we are gonna do that i did want to shower but i'm lazy <laughs> so we're just gonna um do my face right um i'm saying i'm a lot i'm sorry guys let me just show you the first step in my nighttime skincare routine in fact I do the same thing at night and in the morning as well so there's no change in products or anything like that just that um, in the morning I obviously do apply um, sunscreen so yeah let me show you let me just stop talking so to clean my face or my makeup to remove my makeup I use this Garnier micellar water guys I'm in love I am in love. I love this girly so much. Even when I'm like lazy to 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 wash my face, I just use her, her and wet wipes and then I go to sleep. So yeah, and you don't have to use much. As you can see, I still have a lot because you don't have to use much. So I also have my cotton pad right here. Um yeah. Let me actually show you the amount that I use yeah that's it and that will clean my whole face i don't have to do you know um i don't have to do much it removes makeup instantly 
I actually want to show you one side so one half of my face guys it's so difficult to wash your face when you have lashes and an installation on so it's already removed guys like it's already removed um, and this is the side that has um, foundation still and there's not much difference in my face like with foundation with foundation sorry and without like there's not much difference like my skin is not bad I don't have dark dark marks um, yeah like my face is fine it's literally fine I don't even wanna show you how this cotton pad looks it's disgusting <laughs> I am sorry guys, but it's foundation. So let me just show you look at this There's too much light in this room. So yeah, look at that um, Yeah, and that's it for my face for my neck. I also use another Cotton pad to clean my neck because I don't want to use the same Cotton pad that I use to clean foundation because obviously there's no foundation on my neck um, so same step just to clean my neck um, and I do have hyperpigmentation on my neck area and yeah it's something that I am really not happy about I don't know guys like and yes I do have hyperpigmentation on my neck so I use this to sort of scrub my neck I don't do this step every night though because it can get too much and you don't always want to kind of exfoliate although I'm not exfoliating I'm just rubbing this on my neck yeah that's step one done and then for step two I just wash my face let me show you my cleanser I use this Garnier cleanser Garnier Sun do something gum I use this cleanser and I use it with my because I have lashes on um, I can't just you know yeah I have to use these cleansing pads I got them from from Shein and these ones as you can see it's really thin but they do um, become decompressed so they are compressed sponges um, yeah cleansing sponges so when you put this in water it becomes bigger i don't know if you get me it's like those um serviettes you get in fancy restaurants where you put them in water and it's just you know it's not the release but when you put them in water they they expand or um decompress yeah so i just put it in water and instantly it's yeah so i use this to 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 clean my face because I can't I can't put my whole face in water let's do that I, I have to get some water on my face guys um, guys also I know I said I just said this but when are we gonna address how difficult it is to wash your face when you have lashes on it's it's so off-putting like you and then thing but I'm, I'm just gonna stop doing lashes because you um so i have it's too wet <laughs> my 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 sponge is too wet i have my cleansing gel on my sponge and i just do that and i like that it leathers so well i don't like um anything so cleansing gel that doesn't leather like oh to sit um, so yeah, let me let me do that. It's so difficult to do this while wearing this. Sana <laughs> ingaze nkulule. Ingaze nkulule. Um, and I don't wanna wear a towel, like, cause maybe it's available. I is available, and then if you do yam one day, kutoa na ngo na ngiba go YouTube. Um, so yeah, as you can see, it leathers very well. Now look at you guys. And the van jenendo, utu sik, ako, ako kwebu. And I just rinse that off and we'll move on to the next step. So I don't double cleanse, I only use one cleanser. And let me actually read. 
is it water based or what's the other they say it's suitable for for normal to oily skin no guys i think maybe the, the i have combination combination skin i think because I don't get too dry but I don't have oily oily skin um, yeah let me rinse my face I wish I could like prop you guys where you see but there's no need to see how I rinse my face there's literally absolutely no need um, yeah and I have these things for you know but they have foundation on them like they were on my they were in my toiletry bag rather and more was in dark so i'm not sure if i want to wear them i'm sure you've all seen these on you know the girlies it's it's so that um the water doesn't trip down to you know your arms and to the floor so let me actually use it guys so i use um warm water to 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 rinse my face i know we should use lukewarm water but and this one in jenna zabanda you guys i'm so sorry and it has worked for me um so yeah let me just wait for my face to to dry up and i'll get back to you guys with the next step it's not a lot guys i'm not even sure okay it's taking long because i'm talking to you guys but um yeah i'll get back to you when my face is dry all right guys i am fully um my face has fully dried up so the next step um is i use this ordinary glycolic acid i don't know if you can see that yes i use this for my neck only because this is a really harsh product i've heard it has also been harsh on my neck like when i use this in fact you're not supposed to use this during the day it's a night whatever in fact that's what they recommend um but one time i used this during the day and i did not apply sunscreen guys so yeah also i saturate my 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 what's this thing cotton pad with this product and i just use it to I use it for my neck yeah i don't put it on my face and there's we guys in go if swim um that's how much i use i don't even know guys if i opened this thing um correctly because i just poked a hole is that what i was supposed to ah guys is that i was not supposed to poke any hole here <coughs> i'm seeing something guys this is a cap now nah, I poked a hole on the top part. Okay, I have a leg, but can you see that? Can you see? I think this cap is supposed to come off or not. Maybe Diane's are right, guys. I don't know. I don't know. So I put quite a lot. And then I just use it on my neck. only at night and two times a week not more than that definitely not more than two times a week it's strong guys the product even if you search you know this product um on tiktok ordinary glycolic acid seven percent is it seven percent yeah seven percent you'll see like there's mixed reviews because most people are like nah it's too harsh um and remember we are not um we are not exfoliating so i'm just rubbing and that's it with the glycolic acid and i rub it in and then next step and guys i know that it's at night but i won't buy daytime whatever routine things and then by night time uh -uh. And my skin doesn't know if except so good except me. So I use this vitamin C day um whatever serum for during the day. They also have the night one, but and it's a quasi. 
Also, it's from Kanye. Kanye, guys. Um, I love, I love this, guys. I love this product. So that's it. I use one palm for my face and like half half a palm for my for my neck. Guys, I wish I could take this thing off because these are my man's my 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 robe thing. It's already a bit wet. So hope you don't hope that doesn't disturb you um when watching this. So yeah guys, that's the second last step. Oh, I love this product, guys. It glow oil for my nagla product is out of this world. So, I, I, you're not supposed to rub it in. You're supposed to just dab it in. And I should take off this and store. It's looking ratatata. Ratatata. <laughs> I'm in the ghetto. You're only supposed to do that. That's not what you are supposed to do. So just wrap, in fact, pat it in. And yeah, so I only wait like a few, maybe two minutes after this. So that I absorb. And then I use, um, and then this is my last step. I use the Nivea cream for my face. Um, I'm trying to think before this what was I using I don't know but I think Lena guys <laughs> let me tell you I bought this because more than your tank in those all the boost of this one time I don't know which month I was looking for you know I was going to buy my my skincare stuff <sighs> that fake it's skin can don't own I don't remember but we don't the price that I am sorry, <laughs> I am so sorry, and this ends a lot. So I just decided to try her. I'm not even sure if it is for your face, cause I think it's for your hands and let's see. Oh, whole body, including elbows, knees, and hands. and it works for my face. So and I've been using it. I've been using it for quite a few months. Um, as you can see, it is used up quite a bit so i that's the last step in my skincare routine um and i use it both day and night even a globe j guys and i can see even without um in fact me and as we talk only about big big explain but without foundation you know what it me and as guys yeah, that is it um, for my skincare day and night care, guys. Like I said, I don't use different products. And then, let me actually show you, like, my whole body, whatever. After I've just taken a shower, I use this Palmer's um, body oil. Guys, I'm in love. I am so in love with this. I use this before my... And I don't use it on my whole body. I only use it like on my hips and my tummy. I think the thing I found back it targeting is stretch marks. I'm not really sure. I haven't really seen the work it you know, but it's stretch marks is in my belly. I don't really have that much ever since I started using this product. I said your check and we did. Yes, and this check it guys the stretch marks weird in Italy, but I think it, it is helping me with stretch marks. Um I just need to use it on my arms as well because I also have stretch marks on my arms. And then after that I use um Nivea. Also Nivea Nani Dianitanda Nani Diani support the supporting. I use this Nivea um, body lotion, Niayazi, everyone knows this. And then lastly I use um, this every sun sunscreen um, yeah SPF 50 and it, I like that I just spray it on guys the first time I bought it 
mistake yeah I sprayed it like this in a setting spray ha did my eyes not burn did my eyes not in fact yo na yo na yo I I I barely see eyes but obviously if kids I spray me clean because I was just like you know like it's a setting spray and right now for my face I spray it on my hand and then I you know then for my body for my neck down I, I do spray on a shop so yeah guys um hope you did enjoy in fact you don't enjoy so I guess we go skincare don't don't but I hope you did um take a bit of um what's the word I hope you found value in in, in the skincare whatever um yeah and the skincare routine some are quite expensive guys i think all of these products are like 500 rands let's let's see ordinary you can yeah 500 600 all of them so excluding the body stuff obviously that for my face maybe 500 600 for all of the products um yeah guys um I'm not sure when this vlog is ending. I, I don't know. I don't know. I'll, I'll I'll talk to you guys when. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow, actually. So, yeah. City. Um, I want to go to Nespresso and Yapiche to get things for my coffee station. Um, yeah, I don't really have a vision yet of how I want it to look, but I'll just see, guys. I, I'll honestly just see. And I'm not doing too much because I don't have space. So I just want that thing to place my, my coffee pots and. Um, this dispensers yes dispensers for my guys <laughs> my mind is dispensers for my 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 syrups yes so that's what we are doing today today um it's already like 10 to 3 p.m so of course p.m so we don't really have much time and there's a place I want to go to in Weinberg. It has guys. I, w I woke up craving a burger, so I saw that place on TikTok, and their burgers look amazing. Oh, oh! I can go to Stad Burger, which was the initial plan. Yeah, I'm gonna go to Stad Burger in Bryanston. I think 
but i will you know let you know and yeah you'll be with me the whole afternoon so you'll see where i end up going to i do want to go to Stadberger in bryanston i i really want to try their burger guys i just woke up craving a burger i haven't eaten all day and i want a juicy juicy burger and funnels burger you know the mainstream the words fingers mainstream and funnels with a camera one day and sponsor and funny as because um as it dry funny bag it juicy if i had energy i'd make it myself because i make a good burger and it has a jelly bag and the end um obviously um i is a fan but i hope it's really close um i'm trying to think what else do i want to tell you guys no there's nothing else um yeah i think that's all yeah let's go guys oh let me show you what i'm wearing i'm wearing the set from foshini i don't want to show my shoes because i haven't lotioned my feet yet but i'm wearing these shoes from foshini as well foshini san candy bone so yeah everything is just foshini today and yeah this is the hair that i have on today yeah the little girl just for you Guys, I can't find what I'm looking for at all. Um, okay, this is nice. Because I also want a milk frother. And I, I can't afford the one from Nespresso. This is nice. This is a glass plunger that I can you know, froth my milk with this. Um, they have cups. They have cups, but I'm not looking for cups. I'm looking for dispensers. But I saw them on, on Google. Let me just ask.
says I actually need your advice look at this um, stand thing it's so heavy I'm thinking of getting this right I'll, I'll show you the vision that I have for my coffee station I'm thinking of getting this um, and it looks like is about right like with a cup and my and my syrup dispensers that I didn't find but as cool up so just let me know guys but you is open I don't even know when you see this vlog yo and yes because um, I think I won't find anything else that works other than this because my my coffee machine is this color so I think I had to run guys but I'm from Itata I could want to change your minds guys it's a Sunday and I wanna cook I wanna cook for my man <laughs> he's coming over today um, so I wanna be in my cooking era I, I randomly thought about it because I had said you know we, we're gonna have date night and I was like yeah that's fine um, but then today I woke up and I'm like no let me just cook for him you know because it's been a while like you guys I'm embarrassed to even say when last I cooked for him um, a, a meal it's usually just breakfast and stuff like that is this a mosquito guys um, my sliding door is open so that's probably why so I'm heading out right now i'm going to and it's actually late guys but he's coming like maybe around six seven so it's fine it is 22 minutes past two i want to head to woolworths and then in fact i first want to go to nando's and eat i haven't eaten anything this this morning right the, today in fact it's not even morning i haven't eaten anything so i want to go to nando's and just have chicken and then go to Woolworths and buy what I need and then maybe pick and pay as well because Woolworths doesn't have for example the sauce that I want I want um, Jimmy's sauce barbecue sauce or steakhouse sauce something like that I haven't I've never seen it at Woolworths and beef stock like things like that just in don't you um because I want to make beef beef stew and veggies and rice yeah, so that's the plan for today. Um, yeah, yeah. I, I'm not sure of the direction that this vlog is going to take. I'm not sure if this is going to be a day vlog, like a Sunday, whatever, cook with me vlog. Or it's going to be part of my weekly vlog. I'm not sure. Like, I'm really not sure. But let us go, guys. Obviously, I won't go with you guys to, to Nando's. There's nothing to see there. Um, but guys, wait. Sorry, let me Google what time Woolworths at Benmore closes. So that if it closes um, soon, I just go to Sentin City. Sentin City is closer. But because Benmore is... Um, because Benmore is a shopping center, it's not a mall. I... Nando's is there. I don't need to climb any stairs, whatever, go into any more. But if Woolworths in Benmore closes soon, then obviously I won't go there. It closes at 6, so we're fine. Let's search Pick and Pay. I'm sure Pick and Pay also closes at 6. Benmore Gardens closes at 5. All right, so let's go, guys. And guys, this year I'm trying to get into styling my wigs rather than just wearing them and doing a middle part and things like that so I did this today um, it's giving grown woman <laughs> um, and it's not it's not great it's not great at all maybe for lunch dates and stuff like that and errands because who cares guys and yeah I always I wouldn't for example do this hairstyle J on a radio like day where I'm going to campus you know because it's really giving grown women and I'm wearing a two-piece whatever knitwear set um but you probably see that when I'm back yeah let's go soften up the mess drop it in the water let the daughter find an image with the rest she'll be learning how to breathe
spinning through identity, reveal another pretty little scheme. Save her mind. Hold her hand. And don't believe a lie. You understand me. Walk her down the valley. Pack a piece of heaven for the bottoms of her feet. Teach her how to jump and how to stretch when she reach. Like the angels do. And you gon' make it through now. Guys, I'm back, but I don't think the original plan is the plan anymore because one, it's way too hot. Secondly, um, the time right now is like half past four, I think. But I want to show you what I got from Woolworths and Pick and Pay. Um, yeah. So firstly, obviously, I got these paper towels. I got a pack of two, um, and then I got these i got creamy spinach plus the butternut and i got extra butternut um my man doesn't eat creamy spinach because he's lactose intolerant and then i got cucumber i got tomatoes i want to make salsa or oh, i want the, the original plan was to make salsa we'll discuss what the new plan is then i got um stock beef stock yeah it was my first time buying this i'm not actually sure how it works but yeah i'm assuming that yeah banana is still just that it's in a powder form and then i got bell peppers and got carrots these carrots i got two of these packs and then finally okay not finally i still have like two plastics on the floor and then i got um what's this beef short rib but the problem now is that guys i don't want to act tough <laughs> i don't want to act tough Ushu. i don't think i can anymore i don't think making beef is is viable anymore so what i'm gonna do i think i'm just gonna continue with the rest of the things that i was gonna make um so i got these veggies obviously as a side to the beef um the beef stew that i was gonna make but i'll continue making the rest of the veggie whatever that i wanted to make and then i'll just ask my man to come with um because i thought about it when i was on my way back and i wasn't gonna turn back so i'll just ask him to come with his steak and then i'll just make steak and the nice thing about steak is that um see how it is like it's like 10 minutes max i got um more carrots guys if you love chili food like me, I always get this. This is bird's eye chili. And then oh, I got Coke. I got Coke. And then I got him. This is his favorite wine. Porcupine Ridge. Um I got sweet chili sauce for my for one of my veggie dishes that I want to make. I got salt. I do have salt, but um, the tenge ekaraj lendo now, so it's literally the small size. And yeah, uh, so I again uh, let me show, let me show you. Dinale. And there's nothing wrong with let 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 you what you know. This is the salt we grew up with. This is the salt again so makaya, but the size sana but bendi tenge ekaraj um di pelele kuwa the salt malami so i had to buy this one i didn't even use it that day you see it's sealed and guys even this and i say oh i'm going to eat it and i'll get up and i'll pop any salt and the tanned man is sizing up and then i got italian herbs um and then i got potatoes i wanted baby potatoes because you and tanned guys i don't like peeling but yeah, I got these potatoes, the baby potatoes, basically. Oh, and Jay and his women, and like I couldn't find them. Um, and then at Pick and Pay, I got. I got these cotton pads. Oh no, oh no, this is cotton wool. I thought these were the pads. Hey, the thing, it be Oh, Jesus. Yo, I'm so bored. And then I got the Jimmy sauce I was telling you guys about. This is why I went to pick and pay. 
And then I got um, this L'Oreal Alviv serum for my wigs. And then I got mentos. I got chewing gum, 60 pieces. Yeah, I tried, I guess, and I learned that kind of mentos, but the strawberry flavor. But in Ome, let me try something new. And I keep this in my bedside table. So at night, she didn't know check this. During the day, I don't I don't have much chewing gum. And it's no drink. And then I got this um, Bramley tissue oil. I got this cocoa, whatever, heaven scent. Because in the day, I turned the cocoa, but like, I, I like how it smells. And yeah, guys, that's all I got. Um, yeah, let me, let me actually, what's the word? Right now I'm gonna unpack, not unpack, I'm gonna pack these in, in the fridge and, yo, guys, yo, kushu, shuman, I'm sorry, guys, yo, I'm feeling hot. I will pack these in the cupboards, fridge, wherever they need to go, and then I'll pour myself a glass of, um, the bubbles I have I have crown and moe in the fridge but I think I'll just have crown in my way guys do you say very special occasion <laughs> I don't even know what that special occasion is but in the say very special occasion but it's also in the fridge so if in the iPhone I can just have it and then I'm gonna pour myself the bubbles and then I'm gonna pack the butternut lane or in terms of Fagas Captain in. Yeah, Mandy's Fagas Captain in. He learned so that is our artist Peguin Dream. <laughs> also, guys, would you believe me if I told you that as a Zindo Zimbalwa cost me 1.1, almost 1.2. I spent um, seven something at Woolworths and then at Pick and Pay it was four something. So as is in guys, in only seven hundred tap. Let me actually, ah uh, man, Johnny. Let me actually analyze, <sighs> cause in that door one, it's it's this beef one, one sixteen, and then as new in coke twenty five rand, a wine maybe hundred rand, salt and yas. Hey guys, even if we get oh, if we can pay, I understand. In the it's it's this um serum, it was two something, so I understand if we can pay, but we'll wait. Uh uh, uh uh, and the tantra was kubanga. You the healer, greater is the one within a column as the leader. Teach her how to hold a pretty hand up to the sky, and I'm a wait upon the giver, he'll deliver like a dealer. To take her. Every door and how the windows let the sun in Copy out the key and tell her this is for becoming Even in the fever, baby, cry and get to running And tell her that you better get your bootstraps up You're with the army Ready when the truth act up, nothing can harm me Yelling from the roof, I touch, put up a guard and count to ten Lion's den, speaking with a higher pen Can't be touched by fire then Fast forward to the grown things now I'm working on them soul things now Forgiving all your old ways But it's harder on the cold days Cold days Never been a product of a flawless environment Never acted like I'm higher than You, 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 you And I still pray Dear God, won't you send me a break Cause I, I need to get away, yeah Dear God, won't you send me a break? Cause I, I need to get away Cause I would rather be, rather be running away I would rather be, rather be running Dear God, won't you send me a break? Cause I, I need to get away
Guys, I'm deciding to, to actually cook because um, the weather is cooling down so I can still make my beef stew. It's like 5 o'clock, it's late but let me let me do it because my man is not even on, on his way yet and he's coming from northwest so yeah let me just let me just cook. 